Hello, hello, hello. This is your boy, Brandon Crya, and we are back with a, another reaction. And the reaction, the series we got today is Agatha All Along, episode five. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you think you'd be interested in reactions of all different kinds, subscribe to the Brandon Crya Network. You won't regret it. And Honestly, I'm I'm excited for this episode. I, I've I've I'm looking forward to this episode. I've been having a lot of fun with this series, a lot more fun than than I thought that I would. But I'm really enjoying this series. And last episode we saw it was a it was a creepy episode. One of the sp more it's not really scary, but compared to the other episodes, it was a scarier episode. And we saw Alice, the blood witch, kind of face her trial and have to get rid of the generational curse. We see them defeat that. We saw the teen get injured, and we see um, they saw we saw them heal teen, and we saw the relationship and the kind of affection that Agatha had towards him because she definitely thought that teen was his teen was her son, but we get clarification at the end of the episode through Aubrey Plaza's character stating to Agatha that teen is not her son so that's still a mystery that we still need to find out and yeah I'm just excited to to get to, to watch another episode because last episode was was really creepy and I think it's just going to kind of get creepier and creepier as the episodes go along so without further ado let's get into this Episode 5 of Agatha All Along called Darkest Hour, Wake Thy Power Bar. So, 3, 2, 1, go. Darkest Hour, Wake Thy Power Bar. Kind of animal spirits. Agatha, fine. Is this the, uh, the Salem Seven? So they come in animal forms? Jeez. Let it go. Mm. What? She definitely be- Summoning spell. We left the door open. Mm. What are you talking about? Well, killed her original coven by stealing their power. Because her own mother tried to have her executed. Are you really defending a noted serial I'm killer? I'm dead. She spared their young children. Yeah, and then they became a feral, hive-minded coven bent on revenge. Oh, your shit! I'm interesting. <laughs> no, the rooms are great. Oh, it's a broom tin classic. This is so cute. I'm dead. Here. Say that, yeah, they don't like Our traveling like that. Worse yet, they're an obvious symbol of female domesticity. Y'all are crazy. Okay. If I could just pick up a broom and just fucking fly on that bitch, it's a Quidditch thing. We playing Quidditch, or we 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 flying. If all I need is a broom to fly places, I'm flying. I'm flying everywhere on the broom. Mask can see me in the air on the broom. Sorry, I don't know if I missed that. Do they have to be given the broom? Like they can't pick on themselves. That's probably a Salem Seven right there. Yeah, man, come on now. Bomba clot on the team. Oh shit! Not even casting spells. We're just hitting these witches with fucking wood. Just straight sticks out here. Hey, like what are you? T I'm out. Like all I need is a little stick off a tree. I'm out, bro. I'm flying. I'm flying. Yeah, see, that herb broom had like a little handle. Yo, I'm flying. I'd, I'd get a stick that has like a handle like this at the front. So I'm like this on the broom. I could control the broom. Yeah. No, that's sick. That's what I'm saying. I haven't done this in centuries. <laughs> Look at y'all. Having a, having a blast up there. Agatha probably hasn't ridden a broom in a minute. That's what I'm saying. That shit looks lit. Something's going to happen to them. The road's gonna do something. That's crazy. He's flipping it on them. Yep. He's forcing us down. Yo. Nah. Nah. The road was like, y'all got too comfortable. Get back to the road. Get back to the road and get to this next trial. Yeah. Oh, Salem 7. Avada Kedavra! Sorry. Wrong spell. Bugs in the mouth. Whose trial is it this time? Forget it. You can take the training wheels off. Hmm. That shit probably fell at your pocket when, you, when the fucking road flipped you over. Yo, I I, th I feel like Patty Lapone's backstory or trial is gonna be mad this? freaky. Remember when they showed it a bit? Agatha's. Oh, I'm dead. Dead than someone who's put so many in the grave. Mm. 
interesting. I thought she would have been last. Oh, Ouija board ting. We have to Ouija. Come on. We have to do this. See, when shit just pops off like that, that shit freaks me out. I thought they would save. I'm interested to see Patty Lapone's backstory. If you do so, a spirit will be released. Bomba cla. Yo, I ain't gonna hold you. Ouija boards freak me out, man. Like. And with what trauma? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if they're gonna get into her son, her stuff about her son. Are. Yes. 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 Mrs. Hart. Hey, girl. <laughs> Feeling better? How's? <laughs> what a journey! Shout out, Mrs. Hart. Okay, Kitty, we back. We back. Conspiracy theories on Facebook. <laughs> Drinking before noon. Bringing on my own. Early demise. Like, right? <laughs> That's what Listen, I was saying. Mrs. She's Agatha. <laughs> She's just scared. Okay. Well, I thought that was pretty good. The clock is ticking. Yo, I'm dead. That was actually fucking good. <laughs> She's Agatha. Spirits be known. Bar. T Death. Bomba nut. <laughs> I S. Punish? punish? What? Why you want to punish me? Punish. Yeah. Agatha. She's about to take her hands off. Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious, man. See? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Friggin' Aubrey Plaza. Retain her out. Punish Agatha. Mm. The lies. The cheating. The complete and utter lack of humanity. <laughs> no. Got him. Yes. Humiliation would work too. I mean, or we could just slit her throat. Hey. <laughs> Familiars don't get a vote. Familiars. Whoa. Bomba. Where'd you go? Does anyone else hear that? Yeah, I'm like, is that even Agatha anymore? On the roof? Nah. Exorcism of Agatha Rose. She's faking it. Look at her face. Sweetheart. You okay? She, oh, well, she's fake. Not faking, not faking. Bro. That is, yeah. See? Look, now you're getting lift up in the air by your neck, boom. Well, she's faking it. What happened? She just disappeared because the light came on? I wonder. Yo. Nah. Eleanora Harkness. I was like, that's Agatha's mom. Stop embarrassing me in front of my friends, mom. <laughs> so what do we do? Do we banish her? Punish Agatha. Mm. Leave her with me. Punish her by no. not getting her powers back. No way! You were born evil. I ought to have killed you the moment you left my body. Damn. The only danger to us in this trial is Agatha Harkness. Mm. Leave her alone! Hey! Oh, she's robbing it. She's so quick. That's crazy. Nicholas Scratch. Nicholas Scratch! Interesting. That's supposed to be her son. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Nicholas Scratch. Interesting. What can you do? She's gone. That's crazy. Damn. Saying it's gone. Hey. I'm not. You wanted her power. That's what this has always been about for you, isn't it? Death comes for us all. Damn. Killing people to serve your own agenda. You're so much. 
much like your mother. That is crazy. Alice is actually just dead. No! Killing them too? Are you that? You should see me in the crowd. I'm gonna run nothing. That was a pretty good episode. It was probably one of the shorter episodes of the series so far, but it was it was interesting to obviously get a, a touch on Agatha's um trial the fact that her mother came back to possess her body the fact that they kind of touched upon her son which I, I feel like they're probably going to go more into i know they didn't this, this is a spoiler um but i'm pretty sure, and I, I could be wrong but i'm pretty sure nicholas scratch is the name of her actual son that they mentioned and i could be completely wrong because i'm not too familiar with the name but yeah, it was a good episode. It's crazy to see Alice was really trying to help her, trying to get the the her mom's spirit out of her. And I, honestly, like I let me know in the comments, but I actually I think I do believe her when she was like, I wasn't trying to actively steal her power. Like I think maybe it's like a passive thing that if if witches try and use their powers against her, it'll naturally try and siphon it off. And I could be wrong. Maybe she was purposely doing it. But she seemed like she wasn't at, like it activated kind of like right away. So and it's crazy if Alice is actually now just fully dead, too. So now we have two deaths on the road. We have Mrs. Hart or Sharon, Sharon Davis and Alice. And I was really starting to enjoy Alice's character. So I, I wonder if they're if both of them are going to be brought back or so at some point or if they're dead, dead, like just. You know, I mean, gone. And like I said, I'm interested to see Patty Lapone's trial or if they're going to go more into it. Because are they even going to continue with the trials now that teen or pet? But we, clear, we we know she kind of she kind of she hinted that she was like, you're just like your mother. And that upset, angry look that she had towards him and towards saying your mother you could clearly tell that she was talking about wanda agatha does not like wanda at all so this is pretty much we're probably going to get more confirmation in the next episode but this is somewhat of a confirmation that this is i think billy uh not the speedster son but the one the son that also had uh sorcery powers so i think this is this is clearly him and when we were seeing the sigil come up on his mouth, it was, I don't know if it was a W or an M, but either would stand for Wanda or Maximoff. So clearly I think this is her son and it's, it, I'm going to, I'm interested to see where it goes from here now that she, he basically used his powers and he's clearly more adept and clearly more skilled with his powers than he let on to believe because he took control of Jennifer and I can't remember Patty Lapone's which name and she just they just straight up grabbed agatha and dashed her in like that sinking mud puddle and then he like let let go control of them and then dashed them in the mud puddle so i'm I'm wondering if the mud puddles is just going to kind of bring them into a different area bring them into a different trial that they'll have to kind of continue and complete or what or or is he kind of taking over that dimension and kind of in control of shit now so that's going to be interesting to see but i think i think that's it that i have to say for this episode it was another creepy episode with the ouija board uh but it was good i enjoyed it and i'm looking forward to next week so if you like this video hit the thumbs up if you think you'd be interested in content like this subscribe to the brandon crying network if you think you'd be interested in content like this, trail reactions, series reactions, I'm in the middle of Penguin right now. I'm also doing uh, Agatha right now. I'm doing Penguin with my good friend Jermaine. I'm also doing Bleach. If you're an anime person uh, and you're into Bleach, Bleach is dropping episodes weekly. So we are doing reactions to that. Also, 
Arcane Season 2 is going to be dropping uh, within like a month. I have not seen Season 1. I was behind and it's on my, my list and it's been on there for a while and I've been meaning to watch it. I've been waiting to wait till season two was approaching because i knew season two was coming out i just didn't know it was coming so quickly so expect to see arcane season one episodes dropping on the channel also if you're interested in that just going to be trying to do whatever reactions i can um i think alien romulus might be coming to home like a video on demand very soon so me and my friend jeremy might react to that also so if you're interested in just a bunch of different reactions subscribe to the brandon cry network you will not regret it Let's grow this thing together. I appreciate you for watching. Catch you on the next one. Peace.